Getting colored fabrics white can be tough. White paint is thick and bleach can damage the fabric. Discharge paste is a great alternative for removing dye without doing any damage. And it can be applied using an applicator bottle or painted on with a brush. After discharging color from a t-shirt, I can recharge it with different colors using Dynaflow. For this project, I'm going to shoot Dynaflow through an airbrush. In part two, I'll show you how to use the wicking properties of Dynaflow to recharge using water-based resist and no special equipment, just an applicator bottle. The auto fade pen is perfect for drawing your design before you apply anything permanent. If you make a mistake, it's no problem because it completely disappears after the first wash. In this project, I drew the T-Rex skull with the auto fade pen and then traced the lines with an applicator bottle filled with discharge paste. I used this stencil and a paintbrush to apply all my bird bones. After applying the discharge paste, allow it to dry before ironing. Iron with plenty of steam for the best results. Make sure the room is well ventilated during this step. You should see a color change, but the full extent of the discharge may not be obvious until after washing. This shirt was previously tie-dyed with bleach, another discharge chemical. You can see that the discharge paste actually gets the shirt whiter than the bleach. The light blue spots are the remains of the auto fade pen guidelines. They will wash out along with the discharge paste. After washing, the new white lines really pop. A perfect background for colors as transparent as Dynaflow. A similar result could be achieved using white paint, but the design would never feel as soft to the touch. Shooting Dynaflow through an airbrush is a pleasure. Dynaflow has the consistency of food coloring. It never clogs and it shoots silky smooth. An interesting difference between airbrushing Dynaflow and dripping it is that when airbrushed, Dynaflow does not wick or spread on contact with fabric. You can still achieve clean lines with it and because of its incredible transparency, layering colors is a breeze. The best part is, the Dynaflow is so thin, I never had to clean my airbrush between colors. I only used a few drops for each color and I was able to use almost 100% of that material. The end result is a bright design on a dark background that almost looks fluorescent. The combination of discharge paste and Dynaflow leaves a softer image than screen printing or airbrushing could ever have achieved on such a dark shirt. Watch part two where I show you how to get similar results without an airbrush using water-based resist. Yeah.